welcome to Sadie's Spin Craft. We are going to be spinning some gold. So there's 200 grams here, and well, there's 400 grams altogether. 200 for one person, 200 for another. Not sure if it'll turn out as 200 altogether once spun because you do lose bits while spinning. I would show you my skirt, but I haven't started yet, so there's no point. So. I hope you enjoy this. This is another isolation yarn, days four and five. Um, there was something else. That's it. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. I hate saying it, but we've got to. So in these times of downtime, I am spinning and spinning and spinning. So yeah let's get to it so the way i'm prepping this today is i'm going to break it into smaller chunks easier to manage so slowly pull that apart and then what i'll do is i'll split that into four so find the crease there it is split that in two and the next crease there, another two, so that's those, and then that again. And I'll do that all the way through the fibre so that when I start spinning, I don't have to stop. I can just carry on and carry on and carry on. So this is called Tale as Old as Time. Yes, you may recognise the name as from Beauty and the Beast. The song, Tale as Old as Time. And the gold is for Belle's Dress. Song as old as rhyme, both a little scared. Neither one prepared Beauty and the Beast Sorry, you didn't really need to hear that, did you? <laughs> so, you'd, I don't think you need to see me split all this fibre so I shall be back very shortly with the spin so I stripped it down into strips like I was showing you earlier it just makes it that bit easier just to control it With this being merino, when I wash it, after I've applied it, it will look so plumped up and lovely. I shall show you what I mean soon about the, uh, for by 100 grams of fibre, you're not necessarily going to get 100 grams of fibre because at least 5 to 7 grams will end up on the skirt. You can't really see that, can you? Do you 
Chino said it up is terrible. There we go. I should hope it doesn't fall. It's only got cotton right there. It isn't always perfect spinning. Do have times where Have a little struggle. You can soon sort that out. I'm doing a fart shot, a fart shot would draw. A short fart would draw because it's merino and it's a short staple length. Pretty well with consistency. It's all a nice even thickness. It's 
So I'm going to go and get this finished and I shall show you the plying in just a sec but just to show you, look you see how oh, fibre is all over my skirt, I don't know if you can see it all but yeah my lovely skirt ends up nice and yellow and sparkly. So <laughs> excuse me now I've mentioned that I shall uh, see you shortly. So we're on the plane now. I'm not going to do all of it filmed for the isolation because I think you all need to see something different.
I'll come back in about two seconds for you, but in a while with a finished product. Barb and Reggie, I hope you're enjoying watching it being spun. So once again, thank you so much for sticking with me and enjoying this spin. I've got two lots done so far. So yeah, that's 115 grams there. Got another 85 to go for one. <laughs> and then we've got the other half to spin at some point. I won't do it all for you now. I'll get something else done for tomorrow and for Friday evening. You may be seeing some gold spun again on Friday. But we'll see. We'll see if I can get it finished before. <laughs> see if I can get it finished before the live. And then we'll start the live hop from last minute Laura to me to Evie. So I hope you all enjoyed this. Thank you ever so much. And I'll see you all again soon. Don't forget, have a fantastic time in this isolation. Well, as fantastic as you can. Stay safe. Love and hugs. Have a great day, whether it be morning, afternoon, evening or night time. Love to all and don't forget to subscribe and like the, like the video. I forgot what I'm saying, but never mind. There we go.